Welcome friends. It's late at night. We're here to play some game. Uh, we've invited you in. Sit on down. It's time to get involved in the council. Okay. No, I'm gonna stop you there. It looked like you were about to go. I'm sure if I didn't interrupt you, we would have just kept going all night. But we have some games to play. We? Game play? Yeah. Oh. You know what would be cool? What? If we spoke to Lord Holm at some point during this. No! It strikes me that, what if he's what if he's the big villain and we haven't talked to him that yet? That was our big thought at the end of last session. Yeah. That, obviously, what was happening is... Mortimer is our red herring villain. Yeah, where, with his boy, huge gem. With his huge gem and his just perfectly coiffed facial hair. Um, he really seems like a guy that has that it has it all evil. together and could definitely do some evil. But all he wants to do is make the Louisiana Purchase happen. So like, which we know is a great thing. We know that's not evil. It's a great thing that happens. So it must obviously be the most ugly character in the game. Because we all know that ugliness is next to evilness. Anyway, here I go. I think he's striking. Wait, I don't want to do this. Oh, no. Back me up. Just say play. I should just... No? Yeah. Play. There it is. It's a good, an auspicious start. An auspicious start. I can't wait for all the quick time events that I'm going to fail. This episode. I don't understand. I spoke to him only recently. Oh, yeah, there was some sort of Monsieur cliffhanger. Perrault. Has lost his mind. It's oh, obvious. Right. Yeah, we, we stopped the guy from killing himself. French to make a spectacle of themselves. Well, once again, it has worked. Hey, let us settle down, please. Oh, we are good. all look into my sure, gem, if you will. Let us celebrate Louis' courage. He enabled us to avert a tragedy. Yes, that was very noble of you, Louis. You have given us all a fine lesson in courage. Uh huh. Thank you. He owes you his life. That's quite something. That madman deserves to die. We are providing this. Wow, that's a strong. <laughs> yeah, that idiot. What a strong opinion. I think everyone needs a little rest. You know, it's kind of refreshing, actually, honestly, to have someone who just like is stalwartly dressed like an asshole. Yeah. I I appreciate that. Oh, we're we're almost running out of books. We won't. Trust me, I'll find more books. Okay, this. This is good. Sure. I mean, at this point, just pick what we can. There's so few books left. I'll do that. Oh, uh, such fuges. And I'll do... I didn't get it. Sure. Works for me. Anything to do around here before I talk to that guy? You know there may be. There always may be. This could be the one coin that you I've, miss forever. I think I've really, really done most of this room. Bird's still alive. It's Bird's good news. still alive. Can't take any more grapes. Can't take any more chocolate. The the things on the desk are still on the desk. Sorry, this is my power play at the start of every meeting. Yeah, just kind of circumnavigate the room. Pretend like I just want to look at some books. Yeah, so what is he weak to? We don't know yet, right? He's just strong to everything. Louis, I wanted to thank he you personally. He cannot be touched I by what you did to save Monsieur Peru's life. You have given us the all thing that starts with the C, and he can't courage. be touched don't by, mention, I believe, what, science you would have and done probably occultism. I was yeah. just quicker. Ah, humility is a fine. It's weird that he said the exact same thing Where that Emily In said. About I've the fine listening courage. Yeah. I didn't want him trying to take his life again. Or worse yet, attacking one of the guests. When in despair, Monsieur Peru is clearly a dangerous man. You can use a devil's thorn if you want to be sure. It'd be interesting to use a devil's thorn. Okay. Wait, we're good to go on these, it looks like. But that one's free. Tell me, my lord, what did you expect of him exactly? I found it difficult to understand what his role was here. In fact, I asked him here to speak about our collaboration. His mission was soon to come to an end, and Wink. I was hoping to persuade him to slow down. I had a few interesting missions abroad to propose to him. Did you tell him that? I just let him know that perhaps it was time to... <laughs> he took things a little literally. Else. 
On that note, my lord, I'll be leaving you. Have we covered everything? Absolutely. What? Oh, Louis. Uh, one of course, more thing, yeah. Please. I wanted to thank you for your support. There's, he's really glitching conference. during this. Have you noticed? I have noticed choice, the And it gives me tremendous satisfaction to have Maybe it's the angle. Project. Yeah, it must be. He doesn't like that angle. Ha! No, he's still doing it. I mean, I don't think we're going to lose. I don't know that it's worth it, though. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Lord Mortar, are you feeling well? Are you? Sir, are you okay? I'm really enjoying this. Hmm. Oh, you're agonizing over this. Yeah, sorry. I'm actually thinking about the decision that we're about to make. Okay. It's fine. What is at stake is worth it, my lord. Now, I won't hide from you the fact that I have no idea. It doesn't matter. What it turns out we'll talk about we both of them. get a unanimous vote. Trust me, Louis. We still have a trust me, to play. Louis. We'll see. Anything so you're using the evil politics. voice, but we obviously you. know this guy's not going to be the big evil. I didn't use my the evil BBEG, voice. I said it exactly. I said it exactly the I'm same way that he said it. Fuck! Well, talk to me. I use my devil thorn and everything. Talk to me. That's okay. It's he, almost out. I feel like he knows we used our devil thorn. <laughs> that would like, be we very gonna, funny. We were gonna have a real good conversation, but uh, then you had to go pull that shit. No, so, I think uh, I think instead what he would do is he would just like juggle for a hundred seconds and then ask you the question. <laughs> is this for me? Once again, I've been you already opened it. absolutely bamboozled by the armrest of the couch. That's fine. I think we should check on Peru. I don't trust when they say they've just sedated him. He's very sedated. He's just dead. Full darkness stars. Your guess is not sufficient. Tell the other for crying out loud. Remember to close my window once you've done my room. This is in Corsica, you know. I'm freezing. Of course, sir. I'll see to it straight away. Good. Monsieur Bonaparte. Louis, once again, bravo for what you did. For if it weren't for you, Peru would have blown his brains out. You've got courage. I like this. We just lost a vote for the next conference, and we already had fewer votes than Holm. I, must I mean, it has to be unanimous anyway. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, it really, it really does not matter. Uh... Excuse me, sir, but given recent events, I find Got him. Kind of <laughs> hey, <laughs> these Frenchmen, they love their etiquette. So yes, yes, I know. You must find me inhumane. But what can I do? We I just get so excited. On the fate of our nations, Louis. It is time you realize what is at stake here. I hold nothing against Monsieur Peru personally, but what concerns me most right now is to not lose sight of the objectives of this meeting. Objectives. In short, we wow, have he really got groups. into this real fast you now. as a first timer. Just a minute. <laughs> what? Duchess Hillsborough. The little tiny like grammatical that? errors really oh, get me. Nothing worth yeah. worrying about. The pretty little pudding eater found no better tactic than to. Does he not know that I am immune to shows of force? He would have been better off with etiquette. We wouldn't have wasted part of the night talking for nothing. Oh, so Emily did sleep with him. Shut your hole. Shut your hole, you swine. Threatened you, you say? That's what I said. I think I'm going to have to be careful of English troops crisscrossing the Mediterranean for a while. The witch would let loose the wrath of the English crown on my august person. But if she thinks that would scare a Bonaparte, she is mistaken. Now, Louis, time is running short, and as I said, I'm in a hurry. I have to go now. I will see you later. Hmm. Well, at least we can uh, rest assured that our girl yeah. has slept with perhaps friend, one fewer person than we thought our, our our person who is friendly with us that is also a girl uh it's only sorry sir but you cannot go through yeah you weren't here have very clear instructions from lord mortimer monsieur uh, can we carry must rest i don't think so anyway in peace oh it wouldn't even let me try to karen that's a bummer the thing about it is i feel like in games that claim to have branching pathways, it seems like it would have been easy to let him shoot himself. I believe I was in favor of it. I believe 
believe you were too. If he, uh... I had something that I just have a problem doing. I get it. I'm just saying that if they wanted to converge oh. the timelines, as it were... They would kill him now. They would kill him now, yeah. I think that's likely. So in that way, I would be disappointed because it would mean that they... We still don't know exactly how much real decision-mattering branching paths happens in this game so far. So yeah. I think that it would be a bad sign if after a clear uh, diversion point, they were to so immediately bring them back together. But Dear we'll see what happens. Son, I'm writing to implore you to act quickly. Situation. Okay, we've definitely been here before. Yeah. Everything in here we've already seen. It just, you know, I feel like they could update some of this stuff every now and then. They could. Yeah, it's a, it's a, I think it's a small team working on this one. That's true. But, yeah, you're right, because some, sometimes terrific. they're like, oh, you could have done this, or you could have seen this person, so it does incentivize you to look around To go a and bunch. do everything every time. What is this? this? No, we have yeah. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna insist. Nothing. Nothing. Insist again. Emily? Emily, are you there? You must Emily. insist yes. three times. Louis, is that you? Yes, let me in. I... I'm sorry, Louis. I don't feel very well. I'll see you later. Are you sure everything's all right? Are you still there? Huh. This is a weird interaction. Perhaps we're speaking to Emma. You know that they can't shoot that twin shot without making it so that you think you're talking to one but talking to the other. Of course. Even if she's supposed to be dead. I don't care if she's supposed to be dead. No, she's not supposed to be dead. We've been told that she's not. Oh, right. She's not dead. She just got shot. I have no time. I was about to join Sir Gregory. Come back later. Man, there's so many people we could possibly talk to. I wanted to talk to you a moment. Ago. I am expected. I'm sorry. We shall talk later. Well, I'll just have fun in your room, I guess. Oh, no, I won't. Huh. Having a lot of good interaction. Well, good is a strong word. Ooh, maybe we can finally go in Piaggi's room. Hell yeah! Everyone's being so weird. This feels like, uh... This feels like in an Agatha Christie book right before the murder, or if you like, in a Nancy Drew game where okay. you're about to be bodily threatened. So, okay, so yeah, in I feel like we can we we know where to find pretty much everyone. Yeah, we don't know where to find home. Where? That's because maybe because maybe if you talk to him even once. Where do we find home? I think he's on the upper level along with. Oh, he's like Mortimer. in the opposite upper level? Yeah. Ooh, hello. It's Carmelite water. They say that if you drink this, it gives you a real oh, boost. You. Oh, as if you're not intimately familiar. I was reading the label, okay. It gives you a boost. I would like to look up if this is a real thing. Carmelite water? Yeah, or okay. like a euphemism for a different thing. It's an alcoholic extract of lemon balm and other herbs. Initially created in the 14th century by Carmelite nuns from the Abbey of Saint Just. Saint Just. It is used as an herbal tonic and toilet water. Okay. Otherwise known as perfume. So we're just gonna slap a little bit of perfume on us and then we can do anything. Which is really, I guess, how. That's how I do it, yeah. Yeah, how it's done. What do you want from me, Duriche? Get on with it. I'm busy. I wanted to speak to you about the conference. Listen, you chose your side. You had every possible reason to make the right choice, but you preferred to commit yourself to Mortimer. Good luck, because <laughs> it's a lost battle. <laughs> the subject is closed. Anything else? How about that book? What a tragedy about Why are these timed? Because he's busy are you and tired. Joking? I don't know why you don't ask him about the book. That bonehead had it coming to him. That's the only thing he wants to talk about. Psychology is his weakness? No, diversion is, for sure. Oh, you're right. How can you say that? 
Ever since I found out that footprints incriminating him were found next to Elizabeth's body. You can be we'll sure that. given the opportunity, probably, probably I would have put us. a bullet in his no, mouth I don't think myself. So. Yeah, there we go. As I was passing by your room, I wondered if you'd made any progress with your search for the Alazif. Hmm. Uh, do you remember our little discussion last time, Derisha? Indeed, I do. So, please go straight to hell and stop <laughs> wasting my time. You like Muller's energy. Excuse me, this is the wrong room. That's a weird way to leave the conversation. But okay. Maybe this is Holmes' room. If that's Holmes' room, then where's his name card? Nope, that's not the one. I want to go here. What are you trying to do? Open the menu? I'm trying to remember how I... Yeah, okay, maps. Oh, I see. Tower room. It's an empty room. If you go up. If you hit up, it'll go to the third floor, which I believe is where he is. But maybe not. It seems not. Just more Maybe he's office. on the first floor. Oh, no. Can you go even further up? No. First floor. He's possibly... Okay. This. Okay, this is Piaggi's room. He's possibly this circular room that we've never been in. Because this is Piaggi's room. Check the first floor. There's no bedrooms on the first floor. I guess not. Underground? Did we go underground? Yeah, that's where the crypt is. Where your mom was. You're alright, our mom was in the crypt. Can you go f all the way up? Okay, yeah, okay. So he'll never sleep. He's a, he's a vampire zombie. Well, I think he's just in that corner. We can't get to. But where's the name card? Hello? Yeah. Everyone's got a name card. Well, Elizabeth's name card got taken down. Yeah, because she dead. Because she dead. I think I tried, I tried to talk to everyone. But you know, this, like I, like I said, this just feels like something is about to go terribly wrong because everyone's loose, emotions are running high. We can't overturn until we try to go to sleep. We run into Emily in our room. People even are though we just talked to so Emily in our room. In her room. Rather. Oh! You did it. Next time, I'll listen to my mother. Not a day has gone by without something happening to me. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Some weird way to put it. What now? Uh, someone's gonna try to murder us. Probably right now. Look at oh, the people. Open up, please. Okay. Coming, Mr. President, I'm coming. Oh, yeah, we didn't see Washington. Louis. Oh, there you are at last. Yes, I... I just saw your mother. She was accompanied by Emily, and they both went into the Duchess's room. I tried to join them, what? but I was refused entry. Oh, no. Louis, this does not bode well. Oh, shit. Emily might want to avenge your sister. I must it's act... It's probably quickly. not the case. You're right, Mr. President. Thank you. It's gonna do a little shuffle. And this way's the fastest way. So obviously we're not rewarded by doing the fastest. No, can you imagine if there was a ticking clock? Hey! I didn't insist some more. Hey! I you were lying earlier. Voice. Oh, they're so thick, though. I can't understand what she's saying. I can't sure. open it. It must be blocked on the other side. I'll have to find another way in. Quick. I try to use... Got a balcon. Whose rooms open up there? Her room. Bonaparte or Peru. Bonaparte's probably the best option. Oh yeah, I mean no one can go in Peru's room right now. 
We were just in Bonaparte's room. We were just in Bonaparte's room. Luckily, he goes to sleep and leaves this room totally unlocked. I have to get inside Emily's room through the shit. Locked. Through the shit. Oh shit. Yeah, that's a diff that's a difficult one. I can do anything. Just friggin' break the window, dude. You don't want to cause property damage. I like how the one that won't work is zero and the one that will work is five. Yeah. That's how they get you. Gotta get that finesse. How did you do that? It's as if there are several people inside. Once again, you're the one who's the victim in all this. What are you on about now? I should never have told you what happened to me. That's how it works. Oh, time to just walk into this. You. Yeah. Mother? How dare you do this to me? You can talk. After everything I've done for you. Oh, yeah. But which is the oh, real yeah. Emily? Right? I gave you my life. That's enough, Emma. Now that Louis is here, you will leave Sarah alone. Cease your revenge immediately. What? What? If you think you're going to... Louis, help me, I beg you. I can no longer reason with her. I am Emily. Quit playing games. I... What? Honestly, don't be ridiculous. No. I am Emily. You are wasting your time. Louis I had a strong well idea of who was who early in this After conversation, and then I immediately lost all of it. Yes, well... Don't you dare bring him into this. This is between you and me. I ask for nothing more, so stop taking it out on Sarah. I... You prissy little bitch! How dare you! Now that I've told you everything, you want to take my place, do you? You are joking, I hope. I'm the one who told you everything that's been going on while you were away. Go on then. That's what you want, isn't it? You want to kill me. Go on then. Shoot. Matt, which one's After which? After all the I trouble know. I've gone through. I think I like Emily you. that's further away from us, but we what should have some questions. For? Here, Louis, take this. Wait, what's going An entire life for this. Go on. Shoot. Sorry, Louis, I, I can't shoot her. She's my sister. I... That's enough, Emma. Louis, out of the way. She's dangerous. Don't trust her. What are you trying to do? Louis, out of the way. I am not Emma. Come on, Louis, tell her who the real Emily is. Wait, I... That's right, Louis. I'm fed up with this little game. Tell him who the real Emily is. Why do these things always happen to me? Yeah. Well, <laughs> Louis, come on, you know how to tell us apart, right? Yes, yes, but I'd like to ask you a few questions to make okay. sure there's no we doubt. Do, we get to make the, we get to do the questions. and open, Louis. Let's see. How can I tell them apart? Wait, I've got an idea. On the night of our arrival... What did you give me is good? You handed me something. I wasn't feeling very well. And you handed me something. What was it? My handkerchief. And you stained it with your blood. You still have it, as a matter of fact. But she already knows all this, Louis. Yeah. It's a waste she, of time. She's updated okay. her sister on stuff. All right. Let's find something else. Ah, uh, yes. Let's speak about my arrival at the manor. She doesn't like diversion. The real Emily doesn't like him diversion. On the night of our arrival, we were warming ourselves in front of the fire. Mortimer oh, welcomed okay. us yeah. in a certain way. What happened exactly? Well played, Louis. Unfortunately, I'm not the one you should have asked that question to. Mortimer did not welcome us. It was Sir Gregory who welcomed us that night. Mortimer didn't show up until two days later. I know that as well. Very well. Let's try something else. On the first night, we went up to bed, but I wasn't tired. I went for a little stroll. Did we get a chance to speak? Certainly not. I was exhausted and went to bed. 
Don't think you're going to get away with this deception so easily. I can assure you, you're going to regret pretending to be me once Louis has exposed you. Right. I don't think I'll get very far like this. I'll have to find something better. Oh, I don't think I'll even wait until he's finished. Take it easy now. Are you mad, Louis? Lower your arm. Oh, I better act quickly if I don't want things to get out of hand. Come on, she's putting one over on you. Look at yourself for crying out loud. You were prepared to shoot me down. In the secret room behind the study. Talk to them about what you've been doing. Maybe they haven't spoken about it between each other yet. On the night of the disappearance of Elizabeth Adams. What about it? What do you want to know about that night? Do you mind if I use a devil's thorn? Yeah, go ahead. Great. Yeah, I think that's what you'd want to talk about. We found ourselves in Mortimer's secret gallery. What relics did we find? Property deeds in Mortimer's name dating from very long ago. Is that all? You mean all those mythological charms? So, there was the so-called Pandora's box that wasn't a box, actually. The famous golden fleece that reeked of dead goat. A broken sword that could have belonged to anyone. Is that enough? Yes, that's enough. You look captivated. Of course, he bought it. That's enough! I've had enough of this charade. Louis, there's only one way to tell us apart. There's just one thing I didn't tell her about in detail. Too bad for you, Emma. I didn't want it to come to this, <laughs> when we but fought. you leave me no choice. What did? Ask her about you and I. You just lost Emma. I indeed didn't tell you everything about it. Come, Louis. Speak about our <laughs> intimacy. Very well. Let's talk about us. What do you think? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, what did you do last night is clearly where they want you to go with it. But what did we talk about last night? We talked about a variety of things. Mostly about Mortimer's plans and then we made like a decision. But I feel like what did you do last night is... Last night, you came to me in my room. What exactly did we talk about? We spoke briefly about your choices during the conference, Louis. What do you mean? Yes, Emma. It just so happens I didn't tell you everything. You s I never told you about this part. I hate you! That's enough, both of you. Now I know who the real Emily is. What? Of course Emily's behind me. You are Emily Hillsborough. I knew you wouldn't get it wrong, <laughs> Louis. No! You little bitch! Watch out, Louis! <laughs> no! Do you have to do that? See what you've done. See. Oh, hey, Sarah. Louis? What on earth is going- Mother! Go. You must leave. Everyone's going to arrive. Louis, what's going on? Duchess? Is everything all right? Go. Go, Mother. No one must find you here. Go. Come, Louis. There's nothing more you can do. But I... Leave us. Emily, what's going on? Mother, go to the crypt. I'll meet you there. I'll be waiting for you. Emily. Madam, I'm coming in. It was bound to end like this, Louis. Let me stay with her, please. Go, I'll cover you. What? What are you doing there? Okay. Stop. God damn it. Now what's going on? That was baffling. I'm so confused at what happened. Okay, well, let's see what the thing is we got. Profile. You fucked it up real bad. I think it's just that you made the choice. Which we kind of didn't have a choice about. Yeah, you think you identified the true Emily Hillsborough. It's weird though, because I thought the one across from us was probably her. 
Yeah, I thought so too. For a long time until the very end. And I don't... But oh, did... shit. Yeah, things are going bad. I can't interact with... But is that actually what we talked about? Why didn't you just ask about... Did we fuck? Well, because I figured they'd gone over exactly what they had talked about. If that's the case, then we would never be able to tell them apart. Well, Wolner was just kind of lying there. But we didn't have that option to interact with his body. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll have to go with that choice, whatever. I, I don't know if it... I think it was right? I'm really confused. Why did she call her a slut? I don't understand that part. I think I just missed something. Good God! They're all here. They must have heard the gunshot. Where is Lord Mortimer? Can anyone hear anything through the door? Well, we look not suspicious if we go and talk to Did these guys. Did you hear that? Yeah, you got the I was not dreaming, was I? Certainly not, Duke Godoy. What's going on? Someone had the bang coming from the Duchess's room. And she isn't answering. Gentlemen, go back to your rooms. Go back to your rooms. I shall find out from Lord Mortimer what this is all about. Thank you. My instructions are clear, sir. No one is to enter. Can't wait to solve a new mystery. A delicious twist. I mean, we already know the answer to this one. Should we go around and try to talk to people? Nope. Seems like no. I'm still trying to think. Why did she call? I mean, but the but the problem is, like, that was a really blah thing for her to say. One of them was obviously really surprised by that. The other one wasn't. But why would she be surprised by it? I don't know. She didn't know. even say that we fucked. You know, it seemed like almost we got... Like the wrong, like the dialogue was switched off. Yeah. Like if, if you asked her, she was like, you fucked, we fucked. And then the other person was like, you slut. That would make sense. But yeah. it wouldn't be, oh, we talked a little bit about the comrades. You slut. What the hell? I might have to go back and look into that. What I'm, I'm confused you, again. I am at your service day and night. Maybe she expected her to be a slut. And then was surprised that it was just talking about the conference. Okay. What can you tell me about Very the tempting to look this up, but I'm not going to do, do excuse it. excuse me, sir, but I am bound by discretion to say nothing about Lord Mortimer's I'm very guests, curious as to whether sir. or not we picked the right Perhaps Emily Hill's row. Like I don't think it'll something. change I think we'll Perhaps. find it. I think this will change something. I think that we'll have to wait and see. I'm sure the game will tell us whether we did it or not by the end. And it will probably determine whether our mother lives or dies. Chronicles of the Amber Princess. As I recall, Dorkin was my favorite character. Ooh. The council chambers aren't locked for once. That's fun. I don't think there's anything in here for us. Except really uncomfortable looking chairs, as always. I I and what seems call. to be a map of something? Is that supposed to be the world? What is that? It is. Oh, it is from that way. Okay, yeah. Not a particularly useful map of the world. We don't want to go that way. We want to go this way. Into the garden by a secret route. Just gonna run through these bushes real fast. I definitely remember the way through the bushes, and I'm yeah. not gonna get lost or make anybody motion sick. Sorry about that, friends. Wait a minute. Uh huh. I feel like you found it so much easier the first time. I did. I usually come in through a different way. Louie, what the hell was that? What's going on? Why were you passed on the floor, Mom? 
Well, I'm not going to really run into here. Our mom's a little bit off. Yeah. Off the Just rocker. Stately, stately walk. Just casual stroll. I'm going to say her name a couple times. The dead server's Louis. not here anymore. At last, there you are. Mother, wait. Get off, mother. Come, we have to be quick. No, wait, mother, I... Time is running out, Louis. First, we must... No. That's enough. I won't go <laughs> a step further unless you explain to me what is going on here. I'm begging you. Talk to me. You must trust me, my son. You are not ready yet. You are the one who should trust me. Tell me what's happening. You would never believe me. I came all the way here for you. Now for I'm you! I know, I just hate, I hate that you ready. would not believe me, line. If only, Louis, I have always taught you to keep your mind open. What if I told you that I'm a ghost? I know you are going to find this hard to believe, but what I am going to reveal to you is entirely true. Many years ago, okay. I found out okay. that demons oh, okay. really do live Is this all? Is this all you're going to tell us? Yeah, of course. And that they can influence our thoughts. Great. Well, awesome. This makes total sense. Mother, Why couldn't you just say this before, Mom? To yourself. I know you're exhausted, but for crying out loud, listen to what you're saying. Demons? <laughs> what next? An ancient monster with a head like an octopus? Yes. What yes, Louis. What do demons look like? Have they got horns and a pointed tail? No, these are not creatures with billy goat's legs. Forget your Christian folklore. Uh -huh. Imagine Hell them yeah. more as parasitic spirits. They possess their hosts. Oh, and ho, ho, ho. okay, so we're a demon. Parasitic I've played games before. Yes, they are capable of going from one body before. to another as they see fit. And two of them are present on this island. Oh, wow. Right. We're the good so demon. Let me guess. Well, no, none of these make none of these make sense. Well, no, she doesn't like a doy, we know that. But they can jump from body to body. Yeah, that's fair. Don't tell me. It isn't Volner and Duke Manuel, is it? Don't talk nonsense. Both of those poor souls are mere pawns in the yeah, hands it's obviously of the real players. Hmm. I was answering at random, Mother. <laughs> Do you really believe that I'm joking here? Many years ago, well before you were born, I crossed paths with one of them. Since then, I've spent my life trying to find it again. When we recovered the Alizif, I was persuaded that Von Burchard was working for this demon in one way or another. But I thought he would hand the book to a middleman during this conference. Not That's to where the I made demon an error, itself. An error that could well turn out to be fatal. Well, both of them, then. The one who Wait, was there the is no the one evil. Was none other than the demon two big in bad person, evils. Mortimer. Not to mention that Holm had sent Volner to get it for him. Holm and Mortimer are demons? B -b -b they both seem to disagree about many things, but I'll admit I never knew exactly why. There are many of them, Louis, not just those two. Mother, have you any proof to support any of this? No. Of course, but you do too. You had everything laid out in front of you. Didn't you notice anything? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Well, yes. Obviously. I went beyond the Nightmare Mother. You understood <laughs> the Masonic date. Uh, I went beyond the Nightmare Mother. Of course, it was during that siege that the demon took possession of Sir Mortimer. Sorry, I'm making a they face. They spent a whole night in conversation <laughs> until the to describe my face. Morning, uh, it Mortimer is perplexed and also dubious. He had charmed the demon, and so it chose him to be its host for centuries to come. But tell me, did you find it's convenient that your host study? body I did can indeed. last for forever? Did you see his maps of the world? He has contacts the world over. Yes, I've been developing the Golden Order across the world for many years, and I've never seen anyone with such influence. It's simply inhuman. Hmm. Well, those property deeds across the world, all signed. I did by think the that was a little weird. And over several centuries. I am proud of you, Louis. I found your notes written in lemon juice. Where all eyes size you up. At one stage, I was so afraid of losing my mind that I noted everything down. Congratulations, Louis. 
Wait, Yay. please tell me you didn't open Pandora's box. <laughs> the urn? No, I didn't. Why? Good. We'll deal with it later. See, he did a good thing. Hmm. He has no I people. Must admit, I found it difficult to understand how and why Mortimer didn't have a place in history. On the continent, Mortimer and Holm are mere dandies who organize society balls. History forgets them with a disconcerting facility. No one speaks about them, and yet they whisper in the ears of kings and presidents. Well, at least one president. There haven't been that many yet. You well, mean the conference? There's presidents of other countries. How can you explain that someone manages to bring together so many important figures? This game is ridiculous. Them? The whole premise of this game is ridiculous. Turns out games are ridiculous. Personnel. The only explanation for this is all demons. Games, all games is I demons, am Matt. Proud of you. You came all this Every way. Every game me. is you demons. Eat, be good, yes. You taught me everything I know. Right. How did it all begin? I saw him. Wh okay. <laughs> all right, easy. I was 20 years old. I was young and carefree. I traveled the world in search of adventure. In the Persian Gulf, we came across an ancient grimoire. I mean, if you didn't know that the, the game was going this way, you didn't. You didn't. If you didn't know that the game was going this way, the second they used the word grimoire, then you ain't played enough video games. I tell you what. That structured the whole. we have to believe her. When all the volumes were brought together, they formed a. What would happen if we didn't believe her? I'll return to Paris. It'd probably be pretty funny. Studying these pages. You'd probably still end up having to do stuff though. All my nights studying them. Oh, I can imagine you doing that. But the writing was in a language I had never seen before. Oh boy, that's Developed difficult. Well Studying a language you've never seen before for days so and days. So I got the idea to form a really small makes occult to circle composed of weird. all the major names. In all the, the big names world, in the occult world. They were all here. Else could crack it. And you found no one. And I found someone, Louis. I found him, or rather, he found me. He was young, charismatic. He was flamboyant. Sir Gregory? Yeah. No, Mortimer, of course. He was a very Mortimer's not that flamboyant. But he was when he was I younger. The book, and he was able to decipher a few passages. We spent several months together studying the pages. <laughs> I guess Mortimer was the one she recognized, so. He helped me understand certain passages he? until Infinitely I realized <laughs> that he only translated a few parts for me. But I had aroused his interest. It was too late. How so? I mean to say he manipulated me. He used me, and in the end, he stole the book with all its secrets. Did he ever go to your place? Not once. <laughs> At least I don't think so. But before disappearing, he proposed a pact between us. He proposed that I follow him and let him teach me, allow him to bring me up. What? First, that I follow him and let him teach me, allow him to bring me up. Oh, okay. And you refused, of course. Why naturally, Louis. You don't make deals with the devil. After that, I spent my whole life looking for him. Three years later, in Berlin, I Ooh, just, just missed him. him. In <laughs> London, I lost six members of the order in a chase. In 1741, in Tunisia, That's... I found a sect of fanatics who had crossed oh, paths with him once. 1741 in Poland, 1749 Probably in some. India. Eight years ago in Venice. Interesting. I wonder what agreed what never to speak to. about what happened in Venice, Louis. You agreed, and that was before you spoke to me about demons. Capital D, Wait, Louis. The baby we delivered, you and me, that night in Venice, did he have anything to do with Lord Mortimer? The child was his son. What? We stole his son? Are you insane? <laughs> I always thought we took him to save him. That was the case. It was precisely to save him from his father. Need I remind you the mother died during childbirth? What became of the child? Later, for the moment, uh, that is not the key issue. No, here. that's a pretty big Once issue. I found the Alizip in Paris. Now, wait a minute. I followed von Borchert's trail here. I didn't think Seems it that, would that child might have been Elizabeth Adams. The demon. No. It was careless of me. Yeah. He toyed with me for Make a few John days. Make John Adams a Until I caught on. Until I saw him as he was. But he had no intention of letting me leave. We are all his pawns, Louis. And if we don't want to spend the rest of our lives turning round in circles here, we must absolutely get off this island. All right, can we move on? Wait a minute. One last thing. One last thing. 
Oh, these are all great questions, though. Only one thing. There's others, too. Check all the others. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Your hand. All right. I feel like we want to know what happened with Elizabeth and or Emma. I wouldn't mind asking about the LZ fee there, personally. I think we know what happened with- oh, and I guess we didn't know what happened with Emma. Well, we kind of know. I feel like we know what happened with Emma more than what happened with Elizabeth. I want to know what happened with Elizabeth Adams. Oh. Louis, we haven't time for those details. I'm sorry, Mother, but I want to know. She was one of the receptacles for these monsters. I met her parents when she was born. One of the demons got inside her. The demon used her mm. to spy on her father, John Adams. He is one of the founding fathers and vice president so of the United So I had to flay her skin States, you know. to get the demon Mortimer out. Mortimer possessed her? Mm. No, I don't think it was Mortimer. Her father, John Adams, hired me to tend to her, but the evil in her was too deep. In spite mm. of the various yeah, treatments I tried on her, yes. I never succeeded in getting out of her. Yeah, not a fan of this? It's well, not it's not what she I'm did to Louis, Elizabeth to try to help but her. But I had to I try everything. Mother, did you kill her? Of course not. Don't be stupid. I had no interest in getting rid of her. Oh, oh okay, 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 okay. Well, well, well. One last thing, many times, please. What did you negotiate about we'll the Adazi for Volner? Absolutely nothing. I managed to pull the wool over his eyes until I found a way to flee. I want to know what happened between you and Emily's sister. Great responsibility often brings difficult choices, Louis. That's all you need to know. No, -uh. mother, I won't take a step further if you don't answer me. You dare blackmail me? <laughs> I'm listening. All right, I used her. So there you are. Happy now? We had the Al Azif, and I didn't think we would be able to escape with it. In order to ensure that the book did not fall into their hands, or that one of them couldn't read in us where we had hidden it, I asked Emily to... It's Emma. Yes, or rather for me, it was Emily. So I asked Emma to hide it without anyone seeing, and then I disposed of her. I am sorry for her, but she was part of the Golden Order. <laughs> the rules are, I can kill you whenever I want. The rules mm. when she joined. What was going on with the cannon? Oh, nothing. It was nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Since when does the order finance wars? The cannons for that Bonaparte fellow? Listen, once in the lion's den, I did whatever I could to appear legitimate. So yes, I pretended to be interested in Mortimer's project about a young military man who was seeking funding for a foundry in Tuscany. Mm. Between you and me, if buying China would have enabled me to escape, I would have signed without hesitation. Great. I found your cool letter. On the evening of my arrival, <laughs> Cardinal Piaggi came looking yeah, that's true. We, had, we, we, we were supposed to talk about this. Letter. More of his lists. Louis, I think I know what's in that letter, and I beseech you to believe that it is the least of our worries. We can sort that out later. But he told me to tell you. Samuel Ritter du Chois, you wanted to send me a letter about Godoy. I wanted you to run a check on Duke Manuel, but frankly, it doesn't really matter anymore now. Godoy is just a pawn like the others. He is not the one I was looking for. Gotta ask every single question. Are you gonna so. tell me what happened to your hand? Better the than best that. for last. I shall show you. Okay. Yeah, we got everything. Good. I think that's about. I think right. that's about ten of my last speak things. about it once we get back to France. Great actions for humanity have been decided by demons for centuries, <laughs> Louis. That's a great They're single line that will sell you on this we game. Are their slaves, and it's time for it to stop. By the way. What was Mortimer's project at this conference? He wants the United States to occupy all the North American territory. France should recover Louisiana and give it to the United States. In that case, the Americans would just have to push west to chase the Spanish from the continent once and for all. And as Mortimer controls Washington, you may just as well say that it will put him at the head of a world superpower. 
We should do our utmost to put a stop to Mortimer's plans. But for the time being, there are more pressing matters. I mean, all I have to do is vote no, Mom. So. That's true. Now, can you kill this servant? He's still alive, and I can't here? kill him for some reason. It's very See, annoying. See, now we're really in the crypt. Yeah, if only we could have just walked this way the whole time. There. That's why we are here. It's Lord Mortimer's coffin. Walking forward to the big reveal. It's just this big old circle in the crypt. Oh. More Bible shit. Oh no. It's Bible shit for sure. What? I protected one of the Hillsborough twins. I could have learned something from the Al Azif. Yeah, I guess so. You know, John Al Azif. I could have gone through Jacques Peru's room to get to the balcony. Oh, you could have, apparently. I thought that there was well, a servant in there guarding it. Apparently, they weren't there at that point. Yeah. Okay, well, let's reflect. Reflect. Do we think we killed the wrong Hillsborough? I mean, the last part of that conversation, it felt like we killed the right Hillsborough. It did. But I, every other it really part did of that seem like the dialogue got crossed up there. really seemed like it was the other one. Yeah. Um, I don't blame you if you killed if you killed if you killed the wrong Hillsborough special know, guest. If you did that, I don't blame you we personally. We specified that I'm immoral, so <laughs> it matters not to me if the girl that we spent a beautiful night with. Oh, what a wonderful! Well, night not even it was. a full night because she left us to talk to Napoleon. Uh, the girl and we not spent, fuck him, mind yeah, you. The girl we spent a beautiful twenty minutes with. Uh, mm -hmm. We're a Frenchman. Maybe an hour. Oh, okay. Uh, you know, I you know if, if she's lost a time because of ha an action that we did. Um, I mean, I think Emma is. deserves her revenge on our mother anyway, or at least take a shot at it. Yeah. Okay. Well, a lot of stuff happened. We finally the other shoe dropped. That twist that we've been waiting for finally happened. It's demons. Or is it? Maybe our mom's just crazy. That would be pretty funny. Yeah. But, but I mean, we've been trusting our mom since the very beginning of this game. It's so true. It's time for us to continue to trust her, perhaps, I think. Perhaps we will see inside that safe or inside the evil heart of Lord Mortimer and Duke Holm on next time on that special guest. Yeah. Bye now. <laughs>